right, AJ, what do we got? All right, what's going on? My name is AJ Writes Crypto. I'm here to do the whiteboard video today. Ben will be back on Wednesday, so I'm filling in one more time. When I was given this uh, task this morning, I thought to myself, what are the three biggest mistakes that new investors make in crypto? If you're a beginner, you just got into the game, you're trying to figure out the ropes, like what am I doing here? How do I make money in crypto? So I made a list of the top three mistakes that I made when I started and that I see other people make. And um, I've had people reaching out to me on social media, on Twitter, asking like, hey, like, what should I do here? What should I do there? Let's, let's watch this first and see if you're making these mistakes. And then if you're making mistakes past this, feel free to message me on social media and I'll get back to you and help you out. Number one, set your goals. Set your goals is not just an awesome pop punk band from the 2000s. When I say set your goals, I say, when you get into a position, no, is this a long-term position or is this a day trade? Am I gonna hold this for a couple years or am I trying to get out when I make 20%? What I see people do is they get it, say they get into a position for $1,000 and they say, oh, I'm gonna hold this for five or 10 years. And then they make $200 on it and they say, oh, I should make profits. Or, or they'll 10 exit and say like, oh, like I'm just gonna see if I can 11 exit. Like, you know what I mean? Like, don't get selfish, don't get greedy. When you enter a position, have your mind made up on like how long am I gonna hold this for? What price point is it gonna get to? Am I gonna get out? And like, if it goes down, am I going to sell? Am I going to set a stop loss? Or am I going to hodl diamond hands no matter what? So number one, set your goals, know what you're doing, have a plan before you open the position. Number two is accountability. Accountability is probably the biggest thing in crypto because it's so easy when you keep track of all the trades you've been in, do you write down the trades you win, but you don't write down the trades you lose. And like, say like if you're DCAing every week and then you know, like one month things get tight and you skip that week or whatever. You can't blame anyone else for any of the mistakes you make in crypto. Out of all the influencers you watch, out of everything, all the information you take in about crypto, no one is clicking the button for you. You are clicking the button yourself. You are making the decision. Therefore, you have to hold yourself accountable for what you're doing. And the thing is, is that you're going to make mistakes in crypto. I make mistakes every day. It's just a part of the game. And in crypto, you pay for your mistakes. You pay for your mistakes. And when you, like I can talk to, I'm red in the face about all the things that I've done wrong, but you're going to make those mistakes yourself. And when you do that, that's when you actually go, oh, like, okay, like I shouldn't do this. I should do that, etc. So accountability, be accountable, pay for your mistakes, set your goals. And the third, and probably the most important thing I'm going to say today is don't fall in love. Don't fall in love. And I don't mean with your girlfriend or boyfriend or whatever. I mean, don't fall in love with your bags. This is such a problem that I've seen, especially in bull runs, when say someone gets into a coin for five cents and that coin goes to $5. And then they say like, oh, like I, I really like that bag. Like what if it can go to $6 or what if it can go to $10? No, don't fall in love. Because if you, when you started that position, if you set your goal, you set your goal and you say, oh, when it gets to this price, I'm out. When it gets to that price, don't change your mind. Hold yourself accountable to keep the goal you made and don't fall in love. These three things here are not, it's, a, it's not a list, it's a circle. And if you keep yourself accountable, you set your goals, you don't fall in love, you will make money. It's a guaranteed thing. As long as you like the risk management is super important, setting a stop loss, all that kind of stuff, very important. So like when you, when you have these positions, you have conviction, you have faith, you have accountability, you have the diamond hands, you know, you're going to hold it. Well, if you lose, like you have to stick to your plan. You can't just say like, Oh, like I lost 50%. I'm going to sell. No, just keep DCAing, stick to your goal, stick to the script. Don't fall in love. My name is AJ Writes Crypto. If you have any questions, feel free to message me. I am around. I talk to people every day about how you can make money in crypto. That's all I got. Be blessed. Have a good day.